Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to edit uh, a drop down list value in ASP.NET Core. So, uh, first of all, check this uh, demo application and you can see here I added uh, a drop down list value and the selected value ex exists in the drop down list. So, there it is. And I want to first of all log in it and the application is the admin base that is the video action. In the video actions, um, you can check this when we click on the edit button. There is the selected category is uh, under in the uh, trailer. If you uh, go to the movie and save this application, then the the selected category is the movie. So you can how to edit that uh, category in the drop down list. So uh, you can check this code it here. Okay. So uh, first of all, uh, create a view model that is video category tag. There is video category tag uh, have all the category is the type of the list items. You can check it here. Also initialize with the new of category list item. Okay. There is no need actually it here in the view model. There is no need. Okay. So uh, public list of category and the categories in the list of. Okay. And in the controller section, uh, get all the categories from the context. First of all, get the item and VM dot categories. Here is the video category tag. You can check this. There is the class name video category tag. And in the video category tag VM, video VM dot category equals to context dot categories dot to list. I mean to say all the categories retrieved from the database table from the context and pass to the categories object in in it here okay and after that pass the vm that is view model also i have a property that is selected in which you can select the item okay so there is the edit and you can check uh, the view section of the edit uh, part video and in which you can check edit part now you have to check your drop down list is here asp4 is related to selected selected it means integer type property and in the integer go to the id into the integer so selected item id is passed into the selected okay and the first item is none okay when we click on the edit button then pass to the selected here you can check it here again the context is there okay and also the category id in the selected you can check it here edit video dot category id in the selected so when we click on the edit button then the selected will pass to the id so only the edit item is is in the uh, list you can check and when we uh, submit button is clear then you get the id by using the selected there is the edit button of the selected okay so uh, there is the selected vm dot selected is there there is the category id vm dot selected selected is the category id so use uh, list of categories as well as selected and here you can pass ASP4 is the selected and that selected pass property to the ID and select list bind with the model dot categories and the model is represent with the video category tag that is and in which we have categories is the list of items. So you can check it here new list of select list model dot categories. So thank you very much guys and uh, keep watching my all other videos. Uh, thank you again.